Roll the intro. Level 15 cards in Clash Royale. What in the world are they thinking? But they're gonna have new gameplay, new events, seasonal currency. That's obfuscation to get our money. Extra layers of money so you don't know how much you're spending. I like it. <laughs> have you noticed the goblin's not that happy? Ah, uh, he's probably not happy at the destination. I'd be a little freaked out too if I was riding the rocket. The least BS Golden Knight. Ice Spirit. Oh my, oh, oh my God. We gotta see that again. Ice Spirit, Inferno Tower, Wizard, Skarmy onto the tower. I would have liked to see that Skarmy get wiped in my opinion. Is it worth buying a legendary for 40,000 gold? Absolutely not, not in 2023. Legendaries are worth like 5,000 gold max. They're not even that rare anymore. King Tower activation in Minecraft, no shot. <laughs> Potato cannon, I like it. We need a 3D Clash Royale. I would play an MMO of Clash. Now let's jump into OJ with the sports. We've got some big news as we get closer to Super Bowl 57 with some big updates and stumble guys who are today's video sponsor. They've officially partnered with the NFL to bring you a crazy new NFL theme map and all new NFL stumblers. OJ's making his way down the sidelines with the end line just in sight, but ouch, he totally gets crushed by a giant football. Better luck next time, OJ. Now let's check the new stumblers. They've got 14 NFL NFL teams featured, but don't worry if your favorite team isn't there because they've also got an awesome legendary gridiron skin. My precious shiny. There's also a new map called Rush Hour. Jump across the top of the trucks in the middle of moving traffic, but don't fall off because there isn't a road. How, how, how does that work? And now it's even easier to play with your friends with the friends list. Add your friends to see where they are online and coming this month, you'll be able to invite them into your party with a single tap. There's so much other stuff in this update like new emotes, footsteps, and taunts, so don't miss out. Check out Stumble Guys using the link in the description down below and help support the Juicy News Network. Back to you, OJ, with the news. The Mega Draft tier list. No, well, that's something that I needed. Yeah, we don't talk about that time that um I went 5-5. Five, five. <laughs> Oh, God. Someone said they saw a dragon in the elixir bubble. Yeah, I can't disagree with that. Supercell didn't need to add level 15 with the card powers. They chose to add it. Now the game will be more pay to win than ever. I have bad news for you. <laughs> the game was always pay to win. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's... Yep. I'm back from a pretty long break of Clash Royale. Why did they make him so zesty? Mm. Calling it now, increase in the variety of rewards equals us adding the boost. Po oh no, they're not gonna add the boost potion, are they? Oh, that's the worst thing in the history of things to come out in 2022 in Clash Royale. Trash. The only good thing about this is that once you have eight out of eight potions, it gives you 500 gold. <laughs> Supercell announced level 15 as early as possible. I feel like it's not its not to like less drama. They're just trying to be more transparent because the devs genuinely believe that progression is an important part of the game. And Jules Z says, and this is Jules Z's opinion, is, is that progression is the very basis of CR. If you're maxed out, it can get boring. In order for us to receive new content, Supercell literally needs to more money to reinvest into new gameplay features and progression if you just want a ridiculous amount of new content and no progression go play fortnite <laughs> that's that's a hot take i don't disagree with him but i also don't agree with level 15 if that makes sense teacher numbers can't hurt you the number Whoa! us outraging over level 15 is what supercell wants and supercell is going to still release it wow that's a lot of words too bad I'm not reading them. No, Supercell doesn't want to piss off the community. They they just genuinely think that it's better progression for the system. That face when you forget Rocket got nerfed and BM. Rocket got nerfed again? Oh, 69 health. Nice. Skeleton Barrel takes that out. Snowball clears the pathway. Goblins get in and that's a three crown. What's a deck you have zero respect for? Egolem? Egolem is high skill, please. If you give a new player Egolem, they're just going to put Egolem on the bridge and then they're just going to feed you Elixir. It, it does take some level of skill. It's below pro, above mid ladder. <laughs> Why am I trying to justify it? Oh, because I'm mid ladder. Woo! <laughs> Phoenix is OP and needs a nerf. Make it five elixir, job done. Or keep it four elixir, nerf egg HP, nerf HP, nerf damage, nerf HP again, nerf egg duration, nerf damage again, killing mega minion, chase changing sizes. <laughs> yep. I do like that they kept it four elixir though. Ice wizard in the trailer. Be like, oh, it's Mehmet SK. This, 
This homie makes some go. Oh, yes. He makes some really good content. Freezing a fireball. Imagine if he had those type of reflexes. That makes sense. If it's a frozen ice cube and you fireball it, it should insta die. Perfect. I don't know about the zap though. Zap electricity on ice doesn't quite work, but I like the logic. Balloon that gives your units fights. Oh, it's Mehmet again. Funny story with this. There was actually a card in 2016 that was prototyping to have something similar to that, but it was too OP because it was doing it did this exact same mechanic. So we never saw it. We never even heard about it. Since this super version of the ice golem has an increased size what about super golem can you stop giving us these stupid potions every challenge i just want my banners man agreed which one are you do nothing select a card and wait play with your cards or select them all how do you select them all that's not nobody selects them all like that skeleton potion from clash wait that's this graveyard this guy's a troll a truly revolutionary concept <laughs> one of the worst feelings in the world is being bad at a game that you're obsessed with i'm not bad at brawl stars or clash royale you're bad suppose all of these super cards were used what would be meta um super mini pekka because it one shots everything <laughs> the entire game would become escort the super mini pekka <laughs> Archer Queen in a nutshell defends with skeletons, ice spirit. Oh my god. She's like a juiced out musketeer. It's it's not fair. I would sell my soul for this emote. What emote? <laughs> if all troops were placed in a battle royale, who would come out victorious? Assuming everyone could hit each other, Pekka would be top on the list because it can one-shot so many things. This was a really good banner. I liked it too. I liked it a lot. So cute. Can we just live in a world where Archer doesn't care that she's three elixir and Ice Golem is two elixir? We need elixir equality. All right, what's the new meta? Golem's back? No shot. Bait's still kind of around. Minor control. Oh yeah, Miner's back. All right, B-Rad, let's go. Slightly hatched Phoenix. Unplayable. Supercell ran by 12 year olds that don't know how to spell Phoenix, confirmed. Makes sense why they want level 15s. Commenting skill issue on a post by a player with 1,000 more trophies than me. I mean, I had 7,500 trophies before it, the, the whole thing reset. Ultimate champion, I have like, I think 20 something grand challenge wins. 20 win before. I'm still bad. So I welcome skill issue. <laughs> let me out! Just hit the random deck button. That's all you need to do. But yeah, it should let you out. 879 chests to go for a mega lightning chest. Nope, they need they need more of these. And they also need more world champion chests. The chest cycle does need a rework. Apparently Clash Royale was the game Samsung chose to demonstrate how powerful the S23 was. <laughs> I was there for the S23 launch and when we filmed it, this was supposed to be part of the unpacked. Welcome! This was all filmed on the S23 camera. Like literally on, on this phone's camera. So that, that's why they had Clash Royale on here was because I, I think I was... Yeah, it's talking about the peak brightness outside. If they made me wear those glasses, I'm sorry. I guess because they're simulating this bright uh, bright inside. So that kind of explains why they were there. It could be as good as a selling point to demonstrate how you could throw your phone at a wall and it won't break. True. I got a glitch that people wanted to be a banner. This would be a good one. I would unironically want that. No new magic items have been added, but how about a zap key? This... Charged magical key opens any chest instantly and gives them three strikes. Okay. A blitz key. Nine strikes. An emote book. Buy any emote in the shop without spending gems. I like this. Have an emote book in the season pass? Supercell, you act if you don't rework the season pass to have this, I'm quitting the game. Elder emote. Let's you buy any emote from the library. Yeah, but does that mean you're allowed to buy the 21 emote or the top 100? Global tournament emote? Tired of asking, is this 1,000 offer worth it? Requirement, enough IQ to click a button. What you get, one champion. 500 gems though. Requirement, you have to win 15 wins in the global tournament. You get a king's chest with a guaranteed champion, lots of wild cards, 50,000 gold, and more that you can't even list. So in summary, if you can't get at least 10 wins in the tournament, then you absolutely want to get a champion, then it's okay to buy. But if you can get 10 wins, then just wait for the next tournament because it's more than twice the value for half the price. Doesn't that make that 4x value? Is the speed boost normal? Three and a half years of boosting? Yeah, it checks out to me. That's normal. Enjoy it while it lasts. You bought past rail. <laughs> Makes sense. Thank you. <laughs> Lava Loon players, when their 50th push finally breaks through because the opponent had a drag glitch. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, is this a bug? I love bugs. Stop right there, criminal scum. 
interesting. The executioner just knew that the rocket was coming, so he was like, I'm, 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 I'm not going to walk in it. We're good. It's a goblin barrel, but empty. Imagine if you played mind games. That's the baitiest bait in the history of bait. That would ruin the game. And I'm all for it. Non-hated decks annual meeting. <laughs> the most hated deck is the deck that counters your deck. I don't, th I don't think Supercell thought this through. Why? What am I missing? No, that's like just if you're to love your own dog or cat. So I can't progress any further because I don't have levels. What's the logic behind this? Because then people will complain about being matched against opponents with much higher levels. <laughs> I don't like this change. I can see why they made this change, but I don't like it. What's the craziest golden night dash you've ever seen? Well, it's clearly going to be this one. Let's check it out. Oh my, oh my, oh my god. Get a pixel of health. Clash Royal art. I like how smooth the, the Inferno Dragon is. Something about that is it's very satisfying. Like a plushie. That's why it's so cute. It reminds me of this heal spirit. Look, look how cuddly this heal spirit is. It's the first time in six and a half years that I'm speechless. 109 health. Oh, of course he's an e-barn user. What clown? Oh my god, that one clone on the other side did work. 51 damage. Wait, it's not overtime so they can still go? Valkyrie blocked that. E-barbs are still going? Oh my god. Finally reached level 11. Somebody bought the $40 legendary pack. Surprise! This is Arena 11 and we're giving you 8 legendaries all at once. I don't agree with that rework either. Matchmaking does not search your counters. Bobby, if those kids could read, they'd be very upset. For every winner, there's a loser. There's no way matchmaking can give you that. It, no, it's it's bias. Anyone that says otherwise, get in that classroom with those kids. KFC is the Electro Wizard. Pretty sure that what he was, that's what he's going for. I accidentally found something. Bowler is Megamind. Hmm, yeah. Rocket cycle players to the lightning. Don't worry, guys. I placed the Inferno Tower. Oh, the 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 balloon from the U.S. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, because it's the balloon and Inferno Tower counts as a balloon. That's that's genius. This is the fifth time I've gotten Mighty Miner and nothing's maxed. I've got all the heroes maxed on my mini account and I don't even have Archer Queen unlocked yet. Think about that for a second. What are everyone's thoughts on this? Trash. The only value is that when it's in the challenge, you can get 500 gold instead of collecting it if you have eight out of eight of them. What is this? This isn't real, is it? Um, that <laughs> we're tapping out. My name is OJ, and this is the Juicy News Network.